What's good, YouTube? You know what it is. OTB Bros back in the cut. You know what's up? Gang, you know what's up with it, fam? Man, back with another banger. Samson, right? Yes, sir. Samson, listen, I'm excited for this because one thing about Samson, every time we do him, he kind of gets a little bit deep. And on top of that, like, he be spitting straight facts. Like, yeah, facts for sure. He says shit other people be scared to say, so. Taxpayer. Sincerely, taxpayer. So, after we didn't did the video. The, That's what I was just about to say. We literally just did the video <clears throat> over the government about to shut down. Unfortunately, I'm a taxpayer still. Right. <laughs> so, this is a letter to me. Sincerely, taxpayer. Hey, that'll be me, you know. <laughs> That's crazy. So, I'm excited to do this, bro. I'm excited to see what um, he's finna say. Samson, he always kind of opens the door for conversation. So, I'm excited to see where he's going to go with this one. Anyone who goes at the POTUS has grapes. You know what's crazy? I'm hurt. I, so I watched, like, so on, I think on Netflix, I had watched the Designated Survivor, which I've seen. Like, I think two, I've seen times. that. That shit cold. Or maybe I've seen a little bit of it. I don't think I watched it all the way through, but I think I've, like, seen it, like, the show before. On there? Yeah. And, uh, they kept saying POTUS. Nigga, I said, nigga, the president of the United States? I said, I'd be fucking damn, but I never knew. <laughs> so when he just said that shit, I was like, fuck. Then he was thinking, like, when he said grapes, so I'm like, he talking about coonas, okay. That's crazy. Whenever we was younger and we was in kids, do you remember motherfuckers used to uh, sign the yearbook and they put hacks? Boy, and I tell you, I didn't know what that meant till we hit about, till about middle school back in. Oh, man. Hags. You mean I used to put hags in my number. But us to say you mean hugs? What are you talking about? Oh no, hags. What are you talking about? Hug me right now. Fuck right. all that. Hugs, right? <laughs> like what are, we, what are we talking about, bro? Like that used to throw me off. You don't see that? The screen getting dark. Oh my phone dying. One percent in the dark. Hold on, gang! You got a charger? Right here. Hug that bitch in. Hurry good. Guess what? The fucking phone died. We couldn't died. make it, y'all. I know y'all see the screen. We're trying to get the charger. We was half a second late. We was half a second late, bro. As soon as I plugged it in, it said black. I said, damn. But it's crazy. At least it, at least it didn't die like halfway through the video. You know what I'm saying? It died right before we started. So, shit, like we were saying, bro. Samson wrote a letter to us. Sincerely, a taxpayer. Listen, bro. I know he finna go in on the government. He signed sincerely a taxpayer. Not sincerely Samson. Sincerely a taxpayer. I don't even right. let Purpose. them hear it. I'm excited for this, bro. Let's get it. I'm hurt. I can feel my money draining. They take everything I'm making. You wonder why I'm complaining? I drink. <laughs> Bars. Facts. That shit. Right. <laughs> True was that right? Oh my god. Is that black? Hurt too, brother. I'm hurt. I can feel my money draining. They take everything I'm making. You wonder why I'm complaining? I break my neck to make this money. The day just come and take it from me. My wages ain't that great in the first place. I should be paying you nothing. But they keep on coming. And they keep on taking these motherfuckers go ham on me every time I bring home the bacon. And I wonder what it's for. Ukraine great funding a war. Have we spent enough yet? Should I guess not? Look, here they come for some more. Fuck me, I'm sore. Sucks being poor. You had the same job for the last six years with the struggling before. That when Trump was in office, fuck all the junk that they called him. I never saw any of the shit that people always said he was in the comments. All of it was nonsense. I ain't even trying to write him either. I'm just saying you gotta admit this shit was fine when he was the leader. It was fine when he was in charge. I never saw bills as high as they are. I never got chills. Just literally thinking about filling up my car. It shouldn't be that way. I don't care about Russia or Ukraine, but I do care about my own country. Is that insane? I care a lot about all the tons of money that we're paying. Because it's mine, not yours, and I'm the one that feels the pain. I get taxed on my f right. Flame, flame, bro. My Samson is up to here. Samson is solidified, brother. He speak. He the voice of the people, fam. He the voice of the people, fam. That nigga saying some shit. Like he said, bro. Like, and I mean, it's facts, bro. The comments and shit about Trump and shit about Ukraine, like, fam. I don't, like, bro. Like, we need help too. Can y'all send me some bread? Oh, Shit. And it's like, crazy because I need less than them. 
I just need a cool little five. <laughs> five, five, and knock my dad off. Like, bro, I can start fresh myself. Like, and it's crazy because I understand the alliances and like the helping, like all that. But to like fun to a point to where like you're hurting your own people, like I don't understand that part of it. Like that's crazy to me. Shit, that's a lot. Stimulus checks out. <laughs> Nice now. But I do care about my own country. Is that insane? I care a lot about all the tons of money that we're paying because it's mine, not yours, and I'm the one that feels the pain. I get taxed on my fucking ass for every dime I make. It'd be fine if they would spend my money wisely, but no way. It'd be great if they would take it and pay for important shit that benefited you and me and not just wage your wars with it. And where the fuck? That's what I'm saying, bro. Like, how can I pay all this tax money? I can't get a little bit of student loan forgiveness. Like, I can't get something that's gonna benefit me. Fam. I can't even get no good roads outside. Like, like what are we talking about? Last niggas with whips at 16. Where's my <laughs> cheese going? Like, <laughs> like, that's my whole Crib. thing. Like, <laughs> damn. Like, I done paid a million myself. Like, bro. Since, I, since I've been paying. Listen, bro. Hey, baby. I can't get a crib for 200K. <laughs> you still got 800k like damn can't get a crib for three like what's the like, issue bro he's saying some real shit though bro like i would not mind paying taxes at all if y'all would like if the money was just going to something that was benefiting me bro like i feel like i'm y'all taking my bread and y'all spending it how y'all see fit yet this it's shit not is not helping situation. the people hell no it's a fuck me we're, situation we're funny y'all and then okay, how about this? Let's all go on strike and I'll pay tax. Let's see what happened with the government now. <laughs> y'all, we're going to do it, y'all. You know what this going to happen? Guess what? The world shut down. Fuck the government. Boy, you know what's crazy? The IRS come get everybody. Everybody. Guess what? Now, now, guess what? Everybody's check is garnished because that's how crazy the government is. They'll just garnish your check. You'll just never see it. That's why that girl you that just was the cafeteria it. lady for the government, she said, and guess what? They're going to see their money again. Right. You won't. <laughs> right. Come get that shit. That's how you, you gotta go down, you gotta go down the list. You gotta go down the list. So by the time you get to me, I almost get my whole name. But by the time you get to me, boy, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't cash out. Nigga. You gotta I, see hey, when you come book me, I'm in a crib, crib. I'm talking about nigga, nigga what? Bro, I'm grinding, bro. Samson going stupid. And pay for important shit that benefited you and me And not just wage your wars with it And where the fuck are all the liberals? I thought you stood against this shit I thought the war machine was your enemy Now you're friends with it? Now you wanna go to war? Now you wanna fight? Now you wanna pick sides in a feud where everyone is white? Now you wanna get involved and go and blow a person up? I'm just saying, I'm surprised this altercation ain't diverse enough No one deserves this stuff I just don't believe the tears you weep Countries where brown people get bombed every day I don't hear a peep, you fucking hypocrites Thought the race that's real shit, bro. That's some real shit, bro. I can't tell you how many times they didn't bomb the Middle East and then bomb the country where there's some brown people at and we ain't hear shit about it. As this altercation ain't diverse enough, no one deserves this stuff. I just don't believe the tears you weep. Countries where brown people get bombed every day. I don't hear a peep, you fucking hypocrites. I thought the race thing was your shit. I thought as long as white people were involved, you don't give a shit. Those are your words, not mine. I'm just wondering why. Why do we have endless money for them and none for Hawaii? Why is it every time Zelensky needs a loan from someone, we're the only ones that give it to him like we owe him something? We got issues of our own here at home that no one's discussing and they keep growing because no one in power is gonna do nothing we're stuck how the fuck we gonna help somebody else when we can't even reach inside our own pockets to help ourselves we could allocate that money to our own people in different ways to clothe and feed and bathe and let them know it'll be okay we could definitely do that don't tell me it's not that bro seriously talking his shit bro because i promise you bro if i had chicken bro i promise you bro i'll bless people bro like, especially while I work downtown, bro, you know how many, like, homeless people and people I be seeing, like, walking on to catch the bus, bro, on the day-to-day -day that I wish I could just, bro, just bless them, bro, just better their situation, bro. One time, bro, one time I was walking out the building, dude asked me, he said, hey, bro, he said, can you bless me with a couple bucks? I said, my brother, if I had it, I really would bless you, sir. I ain't even got my, they ain't even paid me yet. I can't bless you. They ain't even bless me. I, I, I can't even do nothing for you, like. 
That shit crazy, bro. He's speaking some real shit. Feed and bathe and let him know it'll be okay. We could definitely do that. Don't tell me it's not that simple. People overcomplicate this and make it some fucking riddle. Like, you can't just feed everyone. Are you insane? You know how much that costs? Way less than we've sent to Ukraine. I know that for sure. You don't have to be a mathematician or a foreign relations expert to figure out that division. You don't have to draw a graph to see it would cost a fraction to solve half of the problems we have and stop them from happening. I'm just saying, what kind of fucking world we living in? So many billions we've given them. When's Europe chipping in? When we gonna start splitting and stirring up the dividends and begin telling other nations it's your turn to lend a hand? Listen, I don't think Ukraine deserves any of this, but I also don't think Zelensky is as great as they said he is. I don't believe the media when they blurt shit on their shows. You'd have to be naive to think this dude's as pure as driven snow. No one is. Especially when you run a nation, dog. Your morals are compromised the minute that you take the job. So I don't trust Zelensky, Putin, Biden, or anyone. I don't think any of them give a fuck about all us little ones. All the people of Russia, all the people of Ukraine, most of the people of the USA probably feel the same. We don't want this shit. It's only the elites that do. They line their pockets. They profit from this, but not from me and you. Quite the contrary, in fact, we pay for it with our lives and money They take chunks of everything we make, these soldiers die for nothing So they can gain some more power and keep their banks fat And all we get is table scraps, fuck yeah, it makes me mad, fuck yeah, I get a You gotta protect bro, this Bro, he's spazzy You gotta protect this nigga At all costs, bro You gotta protect this nigga At all costs, bro He's speaking facts Straight facts Yeah, talk your shit, Samson they take chunks of everything we make and soldiers die for nothing So they can gain some more power and keep their banks fat And all we get is table scraps Fuck yeah, it makes me mad Fuck yeah, I get upset We're constantly ignored Why the fuck I gotta pay for this? I don't want this war How the Pentagon have six billion unaccounted for But when I do my taxes, I'm afraid to be a dollar short I'm afraid I'll go to jail I'm afraid I'll do some time if I don't pay you back the money that you wasted That was mine, I can't keep quiet anymore It's impossible to shut up I'm Sick and tired of being responsible for all your fuck ups But the question is What are we gonna do about it? There's never a plan of action All we seem to do is shout it And I'm guilty of it too Always bitching and complaining Never walking, always talking Always lipping off and saying I'ma do shit but I don't And to be honest with you That's the reason I don't make a lot of songs And that's the truth I'm sick of bumping my gums I'm tired of flapping my jibs Something needs to be done And I don't know if rapping is it We need a real solution But we need to get together first Because unless we're all in this as a whole, it'll never work However, what do I know? I'm just a moron with a pen But there's power in numbers And there's more of us than them The table is tilted, folks The game is rigged And nobody seems to notice Nobody seems to care Good, honest, hard-working people White collar, blue collar Doesn't matter what color shirt you have on Continue to elect these rich cocksuckers Who don't give a fuck about them They don't give a fuck about you They don't give a fuck about you They don't care about you at all, at all, at all. That shit was e fucking lead, bro. Big Tim, bro. Protect Samson at all costs, bro. He got on that bitch and kept it a hundred, bro. <laughs> he went on he that. got on that bitch and kept it a hundred, bro. Nigga, hey, hey, I'm rocking with Samson. I keep it a hundred. Everything he said was some facts, bro. Damn. Damn. You know what? Guess what? Uh. Election 2024, cancel that shit. Cancel that shit. We don't need no president, fam. We need to come together as a people. We need to have a fucking meeting. Whole world got to come. Whole world got to come to everybody. We got to come together, fam. Figure out a plan. And, and, and put, put something into action, bro. Because the fucking presidents and the people that we were putting in charge to help the people, bro, they're not helping us. We all need, everybody in the world need to go stand in front of the White House. Bro, that shit is crazy, bro. He said so much real shit, bro. So much real shit, bro. That shit was like cold. that Ukraine shit was some real shit, bro. Like you never want to see that shit happen, like, and you don't want to see that shit happen. But like, literally, we've drained like billions of dollars in the funding of war and shit, and it's like, bro, we literally got like shit going on here. Like Hawaii fucked off, bro. Right. Flint ain't got no water, bro. Like, right. we got shit going on here. And, like, we not even trying to help our own people. Like, people here starving and shit. Like, we got so many homeless people. And it's like, bro, we not doing nothing to try to help people. And it's like, that shit is bad. That shit is real bad. But we real quick to, when it's somebody else or somewhere it's going to require us to pay tax dollars, we real quick to get involved in that shit. 
real quick. Inflation through the fucking roof. Hell yeah. Gas prices through the roof. Hell yeah. But you don't want to pay no nigga. Jobs not paying more, paying the same amount as they was paying before inflation. But yeah, we still supposed to be able to afford to live the same. Like, come on, bro. Like, what are we really talking about here, bro? And people be thinking that's just a coincidence, bro. The people always having to sacrifice, but the people in power never have to. Right. No matter how this shit goes, the niggas have money. Right. You have to have money to even get in a position like that, fam. Right. You got to be a fucking millionaire to be with a funny campaign to even get in the office, bro. Right. Like, come on now. Let's be real about it. And then all the motherfuckers who run, they already coming from a political... Trump was more of a businessman, but most of these motherfuckers are already coming from political backgrounds. They've been councilmen. They've been VPs. they already been in the system, bro. Fuck all this systematic bullshit, bro. I'm not with none of this shit, bro. I'm with Samson. Protect Samson at all costs. Facts. That shit was fucking heat. Let us know what y'all thought about that shit. Bro, please let us know, bro. Make sure you like the video on your way out. Comment what you want to see next. Make sure you subscribe. We love each and every single one of y'all. Thank you for all the love and support. OTB bros. Ski. We out, gang.